Greetings everyone, Alpha Magnus here. We have another lovely review. Um, today we've got the Masters of the Universe Masterverse um, Sun Man figure. Uh, I already did the Battle Armor He-Man uh, and I, I, I have the other two as well. So keep an eye out, but we're just gonna go head on right down the line. Uh, I do have a, or an, uh, not an original Sun Man, but a, a, an origin Sun Man. Uh, see the little thing there. Uh, it does come with some pretty decent art. Uh, I'm not going to lie, I'd like to see all this art, like, put together um, in some way to make, like, a poster or something. I don't really want to keep these boxes anymore. Uh, the art is beautiful, uh, but they need to they need to do something with it. Uh, so here's Sun Man. Uh, before I get ahead of myself, this is the flat top Sun Man. I actually have the figure four. This guy came in the three pack with Space Sumo and another pig head. Uh, I just got it for the Space Sumo and then has, uh, what is it? Mattel Creations came out with one and it was cheaper to buy the three pack at Target. That makes no sense. Uh, so let's get Sun Man open here. I have a deep connection with Sun Man. Uh, I, I think I can open these from the top. Uh, so I have a deeper connection with this. One of my friends growing up had a Sun Man that his, his uncle gave him. Long story short, I have not seen him in 30 years. I Who knows if he's alive. It was not a good uh, area to be growing up in. It does look like... Ooh, see back there. Sunny, sunny my boy. So one thing with these these Origins figures, I feel like their feet are meant to either make them fall forward or backwards, and they don't give you a stand. Ugh. Give me some stands, guys. Oh, I thought we were done with this. So he does have clips on his feet. Got those out. Enough of that ear vomit. A um, little bit interesting uh, patterning going on on the legs and arms. I feel like this was, I'm, I'm assuming it's because uh, brown is not the easiest color to um, make plastic of. And these guys are not painted. So um, it's a marbling or something going on there. It's a little bit concerning. But it looks like it's it's through and through, so I don't remember seeing that on uh, on my clamp champ or any of the other ones. A little weird. It is a little more realistic though, uh, color wise. Uh, as you see here, this figure. Hold on a second. This is gonna drive me crazy. What is going on with the brightness on this? There. Jeez. Um, so. A little bit uh, interesting here. They do have his his crotch plate there. It goes to here, but it does come down to like a, uh, um, not a tunic. I don't know what they call this piece, but like a half skirt looking. Someone please tell me what that's called. Uh, and then instead of the, the star here, the star is elongated onto a thing. So this is almost completely new mold. Um, looks like they might have used Mind headless human. Yeah, they use this this body type for Sun Man here. The arms and legs, at least, from the um, 40th anniversary. I'm just waiting for my Dolph Lundgren to uh, swap heads out. I've do been doing a lot of head swapping on these. So this is original. I'm sure the chest is just a reuse. Um, nothing new needs to be there. But he does have these awesome wings, which are way better than that. I, I understand. All right. It's starting to get annoying. This, uh, hopefully that the brightness does not affect it on the. Ah, all right, wonderful. Uh, halfway through that video, it decided to just cut out. Uh, so hopefully that that weird uh, weird thing doesn't happen anymore. So uh, don't remember what I said. So I'll reiterate some stuff. Uh, essentially, he's got the translucent wings. Uh, you can kind of see right there. They are clear. Um, I did put the, 
shield hand here, which this one actually works on like Hordax. Um, and then he's got his like spear weapon thing. I don't know what this is even called. Um, it's pretty cool. Uh, as I said, they're probably gonna reuse a lot of this stuff. Um, star and, and everything. I like that better than this, <laughs> that goofy thing. This is way better. Um, and he does have the star down here and whatever this tunic thing is called. Um, it is using the body mold of of the the big the bigger arms. I think maybe the arms are the same uh, and the legs, but it does not use the bigger chest. So it is still using the regular chest, which is probably better um, for that. Actually, these are the same legs. So yeah, nothing nothing really changed between that. The only thing that changed on the the He Man body uh, previously, it does have bigger boots. I feel these boots feel bigger. Yeah. Um, previously, the the difference between these two is um, is that chest. That chest is huge, and the, uh, the I think the shoulders might be bigger too. Mm, no, they're about the same. The neck area is a little bit wider. Um, the Masterverse figure was a little little disappointing. As I said, I've been doing a lot of head swaps, so get used to that. Um, so I bought this Dolph Lundgren head to go on it. And I feel like it's just a little too small. But then when I put it on the regular He-Man body, it looks okay. It just needs to sit up a little higher. Um, and he's going to have a bigger... Um, bigger hair too i'm probably gonna get, have to buy a long shot i think that's his name from uh because he's got like that mullet styled hair so that, that'll be nice but anyway back to uh back to this guy um he is he is a thicky this guy he is thick i i am i love this figure um for being the second of this wave to um to ship slash arrive uh hopefully you'll get to see these in stores because all i see in stores is still wave two I think it was Wave 2, uh, Andra, Fisto, and Stinkor are st everywhere. Get rid of them or give them an extra shelf to put new stuff on. Uh, Mattel, you are running into a problem at Targets especially and uh, and at, at Walmart. Now, mind you, I did see a lot of this stuff flying off the shelf, but it was this stuff. I saw a lot of people buying this for their kids, not this. And guess what? We all saw the Kidult thing <laughs> on, uh, I can't remember who posted that. We're buying a lot of stuff more than, than, than the kids are. We're pushing this industry now. Uh, they told us forever that we were like 0% um, of the purchasing, but we are way more. And uh, you need to have these figures out, not the waves that are sitting around. So if, if a wave is like over three months old, you need to discount it or you need to have an additional space so that we can have the new stuff out and that's not happening right now the only places that are getting these are online retailers and ordering it through target themselves the other figures are just sitting on the shelves and it's kind of bad um it's going to lead to bad stuff uh hopefully this christmas will will blast some of that out um it's just also weird that there's there's literally a he-man figure in this wave Ugh. right here <clears throat> the battle armor he-man and you can't find him in stores either so, uh, the Charlie Hunnam He-Man, as I like to call him. Terra. Yeah. So, there we go. Uh, we got two out of the wave done. You can check the video for the other one in, in my bio. Uh, and you have a wonderful, uh, wonderful Monday of the universe. See you next time. I'm Alpha Magnus. These are toys.